when you don't have resources, you in survival mode. You know, so being in survival mode automatically rules out a lot of things because you don't care about morality because you don't experience morality. You experience, you know, the need to survive. You don't experience, you know, fairness. You don't experience planning for the future. You just experience my ribs touching. You know what I mean? And it's better me than you. And, you know, it's a survival instinct that kick in. So I think once you get out of the survival mode, your, your morals come back closer to, to your daily decision making. You start thinking about what's right and what do I believe in? But until you get out of survival mode, you ain't got time to be worrying about right and wrong. You worrying about bottom line. You know what I mean? By any means necessary. Creative destruction, the risky business of going against the grain. The reasonable man adapts himself to the world. The unreasonable one persists in trying to adapt the world to himself. Therefore, all progress depends on the unreasonable man. On the hood. It's radicals, you know what I'm saying? Next, we can't breathe. Ain't gonna be no peace until all my people free. Uh, it's been so long for this country, we done bled and we'll bleed. Uh, they try to bury us, ain't know that we were seized. Victim of their sins, foolish pride, envy, greed. They still giving niggas time just for weed. I was taught to judge a man's actions and his deeds. America had black bodies hanging from them trees. Billy Holiday, Nina Simone sang. Strange fruit. In the southern breeze they swing Niggas voted for Barack, thought we would see some change <laughs> But all we really got was more of the same It's a shame, niggas too scared to do their own thing They put drugs in our community, the dope and cocaine If I did it from the heart, then it come with no strains Please don't speak on our shit if you can't understand our pain, motherfucker